My name is Madison Hargrove, and the management myth I chose is that the effective manager has no regular duties to perform. We start off with Stacy, our top associate, Bob, the manager, and Tom, another associate. Stacy and Tom are talking. Stacy says, have you talked to Bob lately? Promotions are coming soon. And Tom responds, why should he get to decide that? It's not like he does any real work here. Stacy in defense says, how could you say that? Bob does everything at our job. Tom, ha, huh, yeah, right. How hard can it be to sit in his office all day on the computer? Stacy still defends Bob. Bob does everything we do, if not more. He worked hard to get where he is, and he still does every day. Tom still doesn't get it. Well, I never see it, and why should I work hard when the people above me don't? Bob comes over, couldn't help but hear your conversation. Tom, thank you for expressing your concerns, but as Stacy said, I do as much as you both, plus some. Bob continues. Being manager comes with many responsibilities and tasks that must be completed. On top of my managerial duties, I much too often have to complete your jobs because it has to get done one way or another. Managers are not above duties of other associates. We started right where you are and worked hard to get here. If either of you want to experience it for yourselves, I wish you both the best of luck in your employee evaluations this week leading to our upcoming promotions. Bob leaves and Stacy and Tom continue their conversation. See, what did I tell you? Bob is a great manager and his job is not easy at all. Man, I didn't realize how hard his job really is. I better step up my game if I want any chance of that promotion. The fact is, managerial work involves performing a number of regular duties including ritual and ceremony negotiations and processing soft information that links the organization with its environment. Thank you.